Mystery at the Occident Express, who killed the famous diplomat in the first-class carriage. Hey there, junior detectives. Welcome to the exciting adventure of Mystery at the Occident Express. Get ready to put on your detective hats and solve the case of the famous diplomat murdered in the first-class carriage. It's time to solve this mystery. Scene of the crime. We're about to explore the crime scene. We'll look for clues and solve the mystery of who did it and why. Keep your eyes open and get ready to be a detective with us. Imagine this. It is 1 a.m. of a very cold and dark night. Benjamin, Mr. Jackson's butler, takes a cup of tea, as usual, to the diplomat. He knocks at the door, but nobody answers. The diplomat's body is found dead on his cabin's floor with a gunshot wound to the chest and a broken antique watch nearby. The window is open, suggesting a possible exit for the killer. Who could have done such a thing? Meet the suspects. Madame Clarissa. Madame Clarissa is a famous theater actress. She acts like dark and mysterious characters. She has a temperamental character and can be very persuasive. Mr. Victorio Blaustein. Mr. Blaustein is a rich businessman who travels a lot for business. He loves antique watches and weapons, and he is very meticulous and pays attention to detail. Dr. Jonathan Blackwood. Dr. Blackwood is a famous scientist specializing in the study of exotic poisons. Some people think he's a bit weird because of his strange experiments. Miss Eloise Peabody. Miss Peabody is a mystery novel writer who has become very famous. She's known for her keen observation and her ability to detect lies. She's always looking for inspiration for her stories. Count Vladimir Petrov. Count Petrov is a Russian aristocrat with connections all over the world. He is very elegant and he loves luxury, but he is also a reserved and an enigmatic person. Hey, do you like mystery stories? Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe so you don't miss the next adventure. Now, let's listen to each suspect's alibi. Madame Clarissa. She said she was practicing her lines in her room with her helper. Then, she went to bed and stayed there until morning. But some people saw her arguing with the diplomat just before the crime. Mr. Victorio Blaustein. He said he was in the dining car, dining alone. Then, he went to his compartment to review some important documents. He said he was contemplating the landscape through the window for half an hour. Then, he went to sleep. Dr. Jonathan Blackwood. He said he was in the library car reading a book about poisonous plants. Then, he went to his cabin and spent the rest of the night working on his experiments. Miss Eloise Peabody. She said she was in her compartment writing on her typewriter. She found inspiration and she didn't want to stop writing. The passenger in the next compartment said to have heard the typewriter until late in the night. Count Vladimir Petrov. He said he was in the bar car enjoying a drink with some friends. Then, he went to his cabin and spent the rest of the night reading a history book. As you look at all the clues and think about what happened, you'll start to see the bigger picture. Whose story doesn't match the evidence? Whose actions seem a bit suspicious? It's up to you to put the pieces together and figure out who's behind this Occident Express mystery. Are you ready for this exciting challenge? Put on your detective cap, use your smarts, and let's solve the mystery of Mystery at the Occident Express.
the murder of the famous diplomat is in your hands. Well done. The culprit of the murder is Mr. Victoria Bluestein. At the crime scene was found a broken antique watch from his collection, and in his alibi he mentioned having been observing the landscape. But the diplomat was killed at 11.30 p.m., and it was a very cold and dark night, so there was no landscape to contemplate, indicating that he was lying. Let's put him in prison!